We are starting to hear from people who knew this local basketball star who was killed in a car crash yesterday. 19 year old Terrence Clark played one season at Kentucky and was nearly a lock to be drafted in the end to the uh, NBA this summer. Boston 25 News reporter Kelly Sullivan live outside of Roxbury Youth Center where Clark spent a lot of time as a kid and Kelly you just spoke to someone who knew him for years. You know, Gene, that's right. So the community is still in shock here. They cannot believe that Terrence Clark is gone. Even though he went off to the University of Kentucky, he still always came back here when he was home. And that's because the Vine Street Community Center was like his second home, where he really developed his game. At 10 years old, Terrence Clark began playing basketball at the Vine Street Community Center in Roxbury. And it wasn't pretty. Terrence came here. He couldn't play a lick. But many people worked with him, and he quickly developed into a budding basketball star. And to see him transform like other kids into having a real skill set and a real talent is just an amazing thing. Clark went on to play at a prep school in New Hampshire and then one of the top basketball programs in the country. When he committed to, to Kentucky, um, he, wanted to, he, he gave us a call. He wanted to do a signing here. Unfortunately, the building was being renovated. Terrence only played eight games as a freshman for the Wildcats due to a leg injury, but he was still expected to be a first round pick in the NBA draft. Clutch Sports Agency signed Clark Wednesday and then confirmed that he died in a car crash the next day in Los Angeles. Some Celtics players knew him and were in shock to learn the news after their game last night. Very good kid, you know, just always smiling, always energetic. He was about to get his opportunity, too. For a player so determined to make it in the NBA, Hinton said Terrence never talked about it. Instead, he said Terrence was focused on basketball in school and always came back to this court whenever he was home. For Terrence, this was home, too. And, and he always, you know, whenever he wanted to come work out, he, he always came here. And he, he always made this his home, and he was comfortable here. Now, Hinton says he has not reached out to Terrence's mother just yet. He says he wants to give her some space, he says. But when he eventually does reach out to her, he said he might talk about doing something in memory of Terrence here at the center. Reporting live in Roxbury, Kelly Sullivan, Boston 25 News. That's a tragic story. Now, Boston's mayor, Kim Janey, just tweeted about Clark's death, writing about his ties to the Vine Street Community Center, writing in part, he was an inspiration to so many other young people on and off the court. Celtics forward Jalen Brown also reacting on Instagram posting this picture with this message saying, I hate the world didn't even get to see how much potential you really had, adding a request for the NBA to call his name during the upcoming NBA draft.